Hi guys, welcome back here to War Robots and to my own Battle Rig account. As you guys can see, we have here a new event and I have won a serve from the last event. Let's have a look at it. And the serve momentarily is at level 3. The hammers are at level 3. This serve here is going up to level 4. Four. At level 3 it has 105,250 durability, 39k mh, but with the increased uh, speed on the serve we have an extra 12.3% of increased speed. Now Victoria B here, Victoria's Vengeance, you can fly 25% longer in the air and do damage in the air as well. That's why I have here served this increased ability damage which is probably also going to be 12.3 or 12.5% when we reach here max tier. Alright, you can also select um, that other pilot. What's her name? Let's uh, scroll back here. Jill Summers, I believe it is. Yeah, you can also use Jill Summers. Summertime, Jill Summers here. After the flight, sir, repairs some of his durability, but I prefer Victoria B because she has this longer flight duration, 25% more flight duration, which can, which you can use to do extra damage in the air as well. Alright, then we have here the skins. This is the Earth skin, which the Unknown Seraph uses as well. But this skin is built into the Unknown Seraph already. You can use this skin for your regular Seraph. And this skin here has 5% more durability to your regular durability on your robot. The hammers at level 3. 2733. It's a blast charge weapon, which means the blast charge is gonna do even extra damage. As well, a little bit, but not much. 5 second reload time. The weapon now reloads once every volley has been shot. So, so no reload time when you're firing the weapon at the same time. You have to empty your clips first before. You can reload your weapon, otherwise it won't reload. Effect of accumulation 54%, effect of duration 0.5, and it's an explosive type weapon. Shells. Alright. Let's have a look at the prizes here at the main event. Let's have a look in here. We have the unknown Seraph, Trixie Hope. Let's have a look at her. Thanks to Trixie's little assistant, the cooldown of the repair unit and advanced repair unit is reduced by 7 seconds, which is this guy here. Then we have here Otto Schreer. Let's have a look at him. Increases the rate of weapons based on radiation, blood hazard decay, or plasma, taran, and redeemer. Then we have here the Unknown Decay, Decay Weapons, Blight Hazard, Eldritch Blight, Cryptic Hazard, look how cool they are guys, look how cool these weapons are. Then we have here the parts, we have Decay Components, Hazard, Blight, we have some gold and some energy cells, back here we have some 150 tokens, and let's have a look in here then, here you can win a Mars robot. That is the robot that we were testing on the test server. Now it's here in the event. Pretty awesome. Let's have a look at it. It's a DSC robot. So here's the ability. The cooperation there, DSC. You can have your information about the robot here. Seraph. That is a space tech robot. I already have, have it. I've shown it to you guys. 
Now the service ability here is the Skyward. That's why I have Victoria B for the 25% more flight duration. See what, the, what it does the Skyward. Robot takes off and activates energy weapons that deals damage to several enemies in front of it. The built-in guns deal increased damage against Titans. Fourth field. For the duration of the ability, the robot has protection which partially blocks received damage that the defense level decreases as incoming damage is blocked. That is brilliant. Built in weapon range 500 meters, so that special ability that is a built in weapon, it, it has 500 meters. Damage that the Titan is 250%. Block damage from 90% to 80%, and the force field durability. Now, I think this uh, serve has an Aegis shield. 90,000 Aegis shield recommended. Weapons are Decay or Smuda. I don't think I have Smuda, I don't even have the Decay, but what I do have are the hammers. Now, I recommend you guys for the Mars robot, I uh, use the Fainters because they are pretty cool here. 1500 um, damage at level 1, 600 meter range, effective duration is 5 seconds, reload time is 1 second, <laughs> okay, brilliant. Effective accumulation 110, alright. Then we have here a Mars robot pin job, the hazard, Captain Clyde, I think he's responsible for the Mars robot, greatly increases the damage and fire rate of the Mars turret. Alright. Um, where were we? We're here. So he's responsible for giving the Mars turret an increasingly 12.5% more damage. I already have her, we don't need to take a look at that. Kate O'Donnell, let's see what she does. Stand still. Uh, deals more damage to lockdown targets. Damage buff is restricted to lockdown weapons only. Lockdown, so you're talking about punchers. All the weapons that do lockdown, like the glory weapons, the puncher, even these weapons here, the sinister pulsars, the regular pulsars, they have lockdown as well, so you have to. When you're using that pilot here, one second here, where can I get into my park here? Punchers, those two locked down as well. Alright, so we are gonna try and do <coughs> this task here. 12 of 15 enemies are already been killed, we have to kill three more enemies here but you have to do it in when you're using Yandi robot so if you have a Yandi robot you can do 15 kills here so let's uh, go into it I'm not gonna use my own robots because you can do this in an easier way skirmish in skirmish you have a Capri Capri is a Yandi corporation, so you can use this guy here to kill your enemies off using Yandi robots. That is a Yandi corporation. So first of all, we're gonna start off with the guards. Now, these are K3 robots and K3 weapons as well. Those weapons have a range of 600 meters, one second reload time, turret, half lot of damage. Fired a turret over there. Do a little bit of damage to the third. And we can uh, we have a increase the speed. Speed. Oh. One second. We're done.
turret. gonna do another skirmish. Let's go. Moon map this time. I'm gonna jump in here with the Seraph this time. And after that we're gonna jump back in with the Kepler. You gotta, you gotta, you gotta figure this one out. You gotta do some damage first with another robot to your enemies and then uh, once they have reached maybe quarter damage or half damage, then you, you can uh, drop in with your Capri and kill them off. But it's not that easy. We're gonna have to figure it out.
Beacons we lost. I did eight kills. Um, yeah, eight kills here. Two million damage. I got more honor points than he did, but he got more damage points than I did. 
you got uh, 2.6 million. I, I just got 2 million. But if I got more honor points, I think we have completed this task number three here. Yes, we did. No more tasks available until tomorrow. Um, down here, we have uh, 50 million silver. The, the coins here are tokens, I should say. To be able to get or win something up here. Down here. You can win tokens, keys, typhon. I have one there, but I, I may need another one for my serif. That is the repair amplifier. I, I need another one of them for my serif. Uh, right now, I can use. What I have, but well, you have to use what you have. I have a last stand on there at the current moment. Um, I can use here the cloaking unit, a heavy armor kit, and or here an overdrive unit. I think I will use an overdrive unit and and a cloaking unit. Um, I thought those were called disguise unit on the test server I think those are called a disguise unit but here they're called cloaking units still so thanks for watching guys let me know in comments what you guys think of this video uh, like the video watch the videos do all that good stuff guys and you can also share my youtube channel on other people's channel so that way I can get a couple more subscribers, that would be awesome, so I can uh, start doing War Robot giveaways for you guys. Uh, I'm currently upgrading here my my surf, it's going up to level 4, so I have to wait to 2 more hours and 6 minutes until this guy here is up to level 4. And I will keep you guys posted here on how my upgrading this uh, Awesome serve and the weapons here, how they are coming along. Here I need a little bit over 40 XP so I can reach here the next, um, the next upgrade here. So yeah, thanks for watching and we'll see you guys in another video. Bye bye.